Okay, this is part three to tips for success on the ELA state exam. Now we're going to mark the text. Um, I've read through the whole text and I, I see that it is fiction because characters are speaking to each other. Um, there's definitely a problem and a solution. Um, Tyrone has a problem. Remember he states on the second page that he wishes he could have some fun. So I'm going to highlight that. And he says, but we can't do anything at all, hardly even breathe, right? If they get any spot on them, right, they'll be washing 100 di dishes. So that is my problem for Tyrone. Now, what is his solution? How does he, you know, if he's bored, he wants to have some fun, what does he do to have the fun? So if we go to down here, it says, Tyrone swings on a long willow branch and lands right in front of them. But then there's a new problem. Because now the children are playing on the willow tree, what happens? Okay, it says their once white outfits are now streaked with green. Okay, and now the guests are arriving. So that's their new problem because now they're all dirty. What's the solution to that? Well, do you remember it was described how the children look when they walk down the aisle? It says, all of the green stains have been outlined to look like willow leaves. And everybody's wearing willow or carrying willow leaves. So we have willow leaf here, willow leaf here, willow leaf here. So that was the solution to the problem. Okay. So... Now, let's go to the questions. And question one says, read the stage direction of the last line of the play. Remember, this is at the end. Grandpa Singleton winks at Grandma Singleton as Tyrone walks past him. Now, do you remember what was happening? Let's go back to the passage. Here it is. All right, here's where he's winking. So this whole part is important because when he winks, what else does he say? I hope those three are ready to wash a lot of paper plates. Paper plates, you can't wash paper plates. So I think he's trying to be funny here, and he knows what? Let's go back to the questions. Okay, look at D. That grandpa knows there's no punishment, so that's the answer for that. Okay, read Tyrone's speech in scene one. Remember, here's where he's saying, you know, he wished he could have some fun. Remember that? So why is this important to the play? It says a reason for a conflict, the character's behavior, the stage directions, or the setting. Well, conflict is related to problem, and that's what's being introduced as a problem. Okay, and in the stage direction for scene two, which of these details is most important to the plot? So remember we had labeled in the passage what the uh, solution was? That the green stains have been outlined to look like willow leaves. So if we go back to our choices, Okay, it says 100 guests, that's not important. The outline grass stains, yes, that's important. The wedding music's not important. The wedding rings isn't as important. So B is the answer. Number four, another good title for this play. Well, if we go back to our problem and solution, the problem was the fact that the children got stained after playing in the weeping willow tree. They were falling and tumbling and having a great old time. So instead of practicing a wedding, the answer would be, falling in trouble. Okay, and that's how you go about doing an ELA state exam passage.